How to replace the thermal paste in a laptop. At the request of fans, today we're replacing the thermal paste on the HP Victus 2021. Let's reduce the CPU temperature by 31.3 degrees in 6 simple steps, easily improving your laptop's performance. Tutorials for replacing and upgrading thermal paste on laptops are available in the main tutorial collection on our homepage. You can also comment with your model if you need specific guidance. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Step 1. Get tools ready. Many tools are needed to replace the laptop's thermal paste. Apart from the thermal paste and thermal paste cleaning wipes, some gadgets can help you to disassemble the laptop much more easily. If you don't want to buy them separately, you can find our total solution combo in our profile. Step 2. Remove the laptop case and battery. Before you start disassembling the computer, it's highly recommended to wash your hands or wear gloves or an anti-static wristband to eliminate static electricity. Place your laptop face down. Use a PH0 screwdriver to remove the seven screws securing the bottom cover. It's advised to use a magnetic mat to avoid mixing or losing screws. Prepare a triangular pry tool and spudger. Insert the triangular pry tool along the sides of the laptop and slide it around the edges. Gently pry up and down after inserting to make it easier to remove the bottom cover with a spudger as additional support. After removing the bottom cover, use two spudgers to disconnect the battery cable by pushing outward on both sides of the connector. After disconnecting the battery, hold down the power button for 15 seconds to discharge any remaining electricity. Step 3. Remove the heatsink and old thermal paste. Use a spudger to disconnect the fan power cables on both sides. Remove the screws securing the left and right fan heatsink guards, as well as the exhaust port cover. Remove any screws obstructed by the tape and take off the heat sink guards. Using a PH00 screwdriver, remove the screw securing the fans, ensuring that screws obscured by tape are also removed. Unscrew the cooling module screws in numerical order. Use a high-quality screwdriver, such as the Cooling Monster Combo 01, and apply vertical pressure to prevent stripping the screws. Carefully lift the cooling module and set it aside. To clean the old thermal paste more efficiently, we recommend using Cooling Monster Clean 01 Thermal Paste Cleaning Wipes. If you're worried about getting your hands dirty, you can use the disposable gloves included in our kit. Here you can see, the thermal paste on the processor has dried up after years of use, reducing its cooling efficiency. It needs timely replacement. Step 4. Clean the fan. Use an anti-static brush and compressed air to clean dust from the fan and heat pipes. When using compressed air, maintain a small distance to avoid spraying liquid. Compressed air can clean small details, significantly improving the efficiency of dust removal. Don't forget to clean the dust from the back panel as well. Step 5. Apply thermal paste. Here we used Cooling Monster Cold 01 High Performance Thermal Paste. Apply an appropriate amount of thermal paste on the surfaces of the CPU and GPU. After applying the thermal paste, you can use the spatula to evenly spread out the thermal paste and remove the excess. You can also use the pea size method if you like. 
Step 6. Reassemble your laptop. Reassemble the laptop following the reverse order of disassembly. Replace the cooling module, screwing the screws back in lightly to about 70% tightness before fully tightening them, to avoid over-torquing. Reattach the screws securing the fans on both sides. Reinstall the heatsink guards, and secure them with screws. Replace the exhaust port cover and tighten the screws. Reconnect the fan power cables on both sides. And finally, reconnect the battery cable to the motherboard. Place the back cover of the laptop back on, ensure all clips are secured, and tighten the seven screws. Follow and subscribe to Cooling Monster, and let us know which laptops to demo this process with next.